faster than the fabric of space-time itself, it can retain awareness of it, and it will essentially unravel. This is something that fills me with dread. At this point, our nighttime sky is shifting quickly, and in a few decades or possibly even sooner, it could become entirely unrecognizable. Astrophysicists are raising alarms, with experts like Neil deGrasse Tyson confirming the unavoidable effects of Polaris. The story behind this shift is quite surprising. Polaris, known as the North Star, has long been a constant in our night sky, serving as a critical reference for astronomers, navigators, and stargazers. However, this might soon change, transforming our view of the sky and the study of the cosmos. For many years, Polaris has served as a guide for sailors and astronomers, maintaining a consistent position in the sky. As a beacon, its steady presence has been crucial for navigation, but that stability might soon be challenged. In September 2023, a research paper from the prestigious Royal Astronomical Society raised doubts about the future of this stellar guide. Polaris is approaching a volatile stage where it could explode, potentially vanishing from the sky forever. Before we delve into the consequences of this potential event, let's first examine more closely the star itself. Polaris, or the North Star, is unique due to its proximity to the celestial North Pole. Positioned directly above Earth's northern pole, it appears almost stationary in the sky. It resides in the Ursa Minor constellation, also known as the Little Dipper. Polaris shines as a moderately bright yellow-white supergiant star, significantly larger and brighter than our Sun. However, Polaris isn't a single star. It forms part of a complex triple star system, with Polaris A and Polaris B as a binary pair while a third star orbits them. The gravitational forces created by these stars shape their orbits and influence their behavior. Any disturbances in these interactions could result in fluctuations in the star's brightness or pulsation patterns. However, the exact nature of these forces is still not entirely understood. Polaris lies about 323 light-years away from Earth, meaning that the light we observe from it today began its journey quite some time ago. Therefore, if Polaris were to explode now, we wouldn't notice it for over 300 years. It's even possible that Polaris has already exploded, and we have yet to observe the light from that event. Throughout history, the North Star has held cultural, navigational, and symbolic significance. Its steady position made it an invaluable guide for ancient sailors navigating seas and lands. Symbolically, Polaris has represented steadfastness and direction, remaining constant in the ever-changing night sky. For astronomers, Polaris has been a key reference point, assisting in the study of stellar movement and variable stars. As a Cepheid variable star, its occasional brightness variations have provided important insights into stellar properties and the nature of variable stars. This characteristic has also played a pivotal role in determining cosmic distances and calibrating scientific instruments. These pulsations follow a predictable pattern, making the star's behavior easier to forecast. However, recently Polaris has deviated from this regular behavior. This irregularity in its pulsation cycle has intrigued astronomers, prompting a deeper investigation into this strange anomaly. Instead of following its usual pattern, Polaris has begun displaying erratic dimming behavior, leading to concerns that the star may be nearing the end of its life cycle. This is consistent with behaviors seen in stars nearing their death. The gradual extension of Polaris's pulsation period, which was once stable, can be attributed to interactions within its star system. There has been a yearly increase of about 4.5 seconds in the pulsation length. While this might seem minor, it has significant implications. Some astronomers suggest that gravitational interactions between the Polaris stars could be driving these changes in its atmospheric conditions, directly affecting its pulsation patterns. Others are more concerned that Polaris is nearing a critical stage that could lead to an explosion. The similarities between Polaris's behavior and that of Betelgeuse, another prominent star in the Orion constellation, are striking. Both stars have shown complex variations in brightness, raising concerns that they may be headed for a dramatic explosion. Stars in their final stages often exhibit such anomalies before they reach the end of their life cycles. NASA has expressed more concern about Betelgeuse, 
but formal attention has yet to be directed toward Polaris. As a Cepheid variable star approaches the end of its life cycle, it undergoes several stages, including the red giant phase and finally the supernova explosion. Given the irregular pulsations observed in Polaris, scientists predict that it has entered the phase of helium exhaustion, a typical stage for giant stars nearing their end. These irregularities in Polaris's behavior align with patterns seen in stars at the twilight of their life cycle. However, clear evidence of its impending supernova remains uncertain. Astronomers continue to monitor these anomalies to understand the fate of Polaris. Should Polaris undergo a supernova explosion, it would likely be a massive event in the sky, possibly outshining the moon and remaining visible for days, weeks, or even months. Its brightness could dramatically alter our view of prominent constellations like the Big Dipper or Ursa Major, in which Polaris plays an essential role. Rest assured, Earth would most likely remain safe regardless of whether Polaris explodes, given its size and distance from us. While a Polaris explosion might not be as visually spectacular as Betelgeuse's, its impact on our understanding of the cosmos would undoubtedly be profound. It could still be visible to the naked eye for an extended period, outshining nearby stars. Astronomers and observatories would undoubtedly take notice, sparking widespread interest within both the academic community and among stargazers. However, the impact on Earth's environment or ecosystems would be less significant compared to a closer supernova event. But what will happen to Polaris itself? What will be its fate after a potential supernova explosion? We should clarify one thing. While large stars typically end their lives in a supernova explosion, this is not likely for Polaris. When a massive star goes supernova, it experiences a catastrophic explosion within, marking the final stage in its life. This process involves the complete collapse of the core, triggering a violent shockwave that causes the star to explode. However, Polaris is not massive enough to undergo such a dramatic explosion. Instead, when Polaris exhausts its nuclear fuel, it will shed its outer layers and transition into a white dwarf. This process will not result in a supernova but will instead lead to a more peaceful end as Polaris evolves into a small, extremely dense stellar remnant. A white dwarf is the dense core of a low-to-medium mass star that has exhausted its nuclear fuel. This remnant is incredibly compact, roughly the size of Earth but as massive as the Sun. Once this happens, we will no longer observe Polaris as we see it today. Comparing the typical effects of a Polaris explosion with actual supernova events provides valuable insights into the evolution of stars and their ultimate fates. Comparing our expectations with real supernova events, such as SN 1987A and subsequent events like SN 2011FA and SN 2014J, gives crucial data for understanding what might happen to Polaris in the future. For instance, SN 1054 led to the formation of the Crab Nebula, a cloud that continues to expand and radiate energy in various frequencies, providing astronomers with a rich field for study. Moreover, SN 1987A, observed in the Large Magellanic Cloud, provided key insights into nucleosynthesis patterns and the mechanics of supernova remnants, including phenomena like nebula formation and the release of high-energy beams and radiation. These insights can shed light on the unique characteristics of Polaris. The formation of nebulae, like the Crab Nebula, is a result of material released during a supernova explosion that interacts with surrounding interstellar gas and dust, enriching it with heavy elements and contributing to the cycle of star birth and death. Additionally, the release of high-energy particles and massive beams rapidly propelled by supernova shock waves has implications for astrophysical processes and cosmic radiation. To make a definitive comparison, Scientists are examining differences in the production and speed of ejected materials between Polaris's potential explosion and other observed supernova events. This includes studying light curves, spectra, and remnants from these events and extrapolating similar characteristics for Polaris's expected explosion. This will help us understand whether the explosion of Polaris could lead to nebula formation or significant stellar distributions. Another important area of study is the pulsational variability of stars nearing their end stages. By comparing Polaris with other supernova progenitors, 
researchers hope to gain insights into the mechanisms of stellar explosions. Pulsational variation in stars approaching the end of their lives may indicate internal instability or impending catastrophic events, providing important clues about the processes leading to supernova explosions. Despite careful observations and extensive research, space experts remain baffled by the anomalies in Polaris's behavior. Understanding the conditions driving these irregularities is key to advancing our knowledge of stellar evolution. The investigation into the factors causing Polaris's erratic pulsations requires collaboration across multiple scientific disciplines and the development of advanced theoretical models and observational techniques. The potential loss of Polaris as a reference point in the night sky raises fundamental questions for astronomical research. Ground-based telescopes and celestial measurements would need to be recalibrated, affecting the accuracy of cosmic assessments. The absence of Polaris would also disrupt navigation systems and cultural practices based on celestial markers, highlighting the significance of this event. The mysterious behavior exhibited by Polaris emphasizes the need for deeper studies and dedicated research. Astronomers must address the complexities surrounding its irregular pulsations and provide meaningful responses. Understanding the fate of Polaris is crucial for advancing our knowledge of celestial phenomena. The uncertain future of Polaris challenges our understanding of the universe, but it also demonstrates humanity's enduring curiosity in unraveling cosmic mysteries. The implications of Polaris's potential demise stretch beyond just astronomical interest. They touch on how humanity perceives its place in the cosmos. Since ancient times, celestial bodies have served as markers for time and navigation, helping explore and chart unknown lands and waters. If Polaris were to disappear, it would not only disrupt traditional navigation but could also have profound effects on cultural beliefs and symbolism connected to the North Star. In various cultures, Polaris has been central to folklore and spirituality. Native American tribes, for example, viewed Polaris as a guiding light symbolizing hope and resilience. Similarly, the ancient Egyptians used the North Star to align the pyramids with its position. The disappearance of such a prominent star could alter cultural narratives and shift the human experience surrounding navigation and direction. Furthermore, the academic community would face significant challenges if Polaris were to vanish. Astronomical measurements and observations rely heavily on established reference points. Polaris's steady role has helped calibrate instruments and models used to study distant worlds, stellar movements, and even the expansion of the universe. Its sudden absence would necessitate recalibrating many systems, potentially leading to discrepancies in measurements and interpretations of cosmic phenomena. As astronomers turn their attention to observing Polaris more closely, new observational technologies are being developed. Advances in spectroscopy and photometry allow scientists to study the light emitted by stars in unprecedented detail, enabling them to detect small changes in brightness, which are crucial for understanding the forces driving celestial behavior. As experts gather more data, they aim to refine their models of stellar evolution, particularly concerning stars in their later life stages. The study of similar stars, like Cepheid variables and red giants, offers valuable insights for comparing their behaviors with that of Polaris. By observing the behavior of such stars, astronomers hope to deepen their understanding of stellar dynamics and evolution, furthering our knowledge of the universe's design.